mysterious cosmic Cassandra, please help. We have to find my house. Without that, I'm just a common talking sponge. Sorry, Spongy. I'm just a little preoccupied fixing the fabric of the entire universe that you blew apart. Cassandra, will you please help us fix my house? Sure, right after we fix your friends, your town, the cosmic order of everything. Oh, my beautiful home. And a delicious pineapple. Here, why don't you take this cosmic costume and enter the portal? <laughs> Yo ho! What be a pirate's favorite cheese? Oh, fingers crossed my pineapple is still in one piece. is pretty neat, but I hope none of our other friends got dragged here. It's just the Flying Dutchman. He has my pineapple, too? That fruit-stealing freebooter is taking this too far. Mr. Dutchman, sir, you have to get your ship back so I can get my pineapple back. But Prawn threw out all me precious socks. No pirate worth their salt would follow a sockless captain. And if I can't round up a crew, we won't stand a chance against the Admiral. You don't need socks to be a pirate. Why, Patrick here has never worn socks a day in his life. I don't even have feet. So, if you need a couple of loyal sea dogs, Patrick and I will gladly join your crew. Socks or no socks. <laughs> all right, all right, but first, ye scallywags, you must prove that ye are real pirate material. To show that you are worthy, you must unearth a real treasure. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Earn yourselves fearsome pirate names. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And find army sucks! I still want them back. Aye, aye, Captain Dutchman, sir! Aye, aye, Captain Dutchman, sir! Uh-oh, I forgot to pack the sunscreen. Well, I guess I could use a tan. But what if we get bleached and shrivel up? Well, I guess I could be a little paler. That should cover my buns. Gee, I hope nobody needs a life I wish I could wear smelly socks. Your 
kicking too much sand in my mouth. I only ate some. <laughs> so gooey. one Patrick hey make like a beach ball and go somewhere else Saltier than a sea dog. a beach ball and go somewhere else.
gosh, real life pirate ships. I want to touch them. Hey, you, could you get rid of those jelly abominations? But if you could hurry, that would be great. SpongeBob? Patrick? You're here too? I thought it was just me and the anchovies. How did we get here? Well, we can talk about that later. What's important right now is getting you and the anchovies and my pineapple back to Bikini Bottom. Say, where are the anchovies? That obnoxious shrimp rounded us up and made his jelly minions stick us to shipwrecks all over the lagoon. He said we're not pirate material. It isn't my fault I have a severe eye patch allergy. Ah! Don't lose heart, Larry. We're going to rescue every bikini bottomite who's stuck here, or our names aren't SpongeBob and Patrick the, the pirate guys. That's not a very fearsome pirate name. Uh, we're working on it. Thank you, SpongeBob. I'm going home to tan and pump. Swamp looks kind of eerie, like the kind of place you'd find pirate ghosts.
abandoned ships, Patrick. Ooh, I'll bet if we dusted off these wrecks and hoisted his socks up their flagpoles, it would look like the Dutchman has a whole armada. Then everyone would know he's back. Spearboat? That's a pretty good plan, but flagpoles don't have any feet. How are you going to get the socks on them? Very carefully, Patrick. Let's go. Patrick, now let's find the others and become real pirates. All we are is socks in the wind. That innocent jelly is not so innocent. Deadly Cosmic Predator. Ooh, that's a big sand castle. Must be where the king of sand lives. <laughs> well, these socks pack a punch and punch, huh?
Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza for you. Ooh, more jelly. This sure is your lucky day! I knew it! But why? Avasti! Before ye stand to notorious pirate captain, Pinza Rosa! I need some saps, I mean a crew, who can haul, I mean share, me treasure, I mean... Wait, no, yeah, I meant treasure that time. Oh boy, treasure! Right! Well, you seem deserving, and present. Now, to share me treasure, you'll first have to get it out of an old shipwreck. It ran off course and hit some rocks in the middle of the lagoon. Someone who was totally not me must have been holding the map upside down. Anyhow, I would get the treasure myself, but <laughs> I'm far too rich to do a crewman's work. Lucky day indeed, Patrick. With that treasure, we can prove we're real pirates. Technically, you won't be, though. I can't be bothered with the bureaucracy of registering a new crew. Or paying for them. Will we at least get real pirate names? Sure, why not? Then we're ready. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you on the next video. Bye.